Hello, how are you? Fine, thanks. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hi, guys. <laughs> in, in, Anger, in Argentina, it's late. <laughs> it's very late. Yeah. <laughs> midnight. midnight. Almost the midnight. Is the superwoman. <laughs> Look at my big circles. <laughs> It's a common thing. Hey, Rene, where have you been? I'm sorry, teacher. I was working a lot. Yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. I had a in you. Hey, you need, to, you need to say something. Well, it's nice seeing you all. The ones that are on time, that's great. Welcome to another class. Great you can hear me tonight. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. Yes. We can clear. No, you know what? I have I no tired. idea what happened. No idea. But then uh, for the other class, I had no problem. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what happened. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay, we're going to get started and we're going to study a different topic tonight. Although we're going to make the final review with the topic we were studying. Okay. So we're going to do the exercise. Is everybody on the platform? Yes. 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 Right. We should be on section 3.5. Let's finish the exercise and that will be the end of the topic. All right. I noticed, by the way, before I forget, I noticed that most of you were sending uh, sentences. They were right, at least the topic, but you were not conjugating accordingly. So, for, and I sent the, the same correction over and over. Let me see. All right. For example, you would say Lucy have as many bottles. I don't know why I'm thinking of bottles as Mark, for example. So this is incorrect, right? Yes. Why is it incorrect? Um, has, have, has, 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 okay. Has. So. Has. Mm -hmm. For example, then we said, uh, my mother, um, or, or for example, my room have, but there was another verb. Oh, I know, I know, I know. For example, Marta eats as much Price. Gonna say drink. So that it is some kind of a drink, drink. as much water. As much okay. water. Okay, so correct about this. Drink. Uh, drink. Drinks. Is, drinks. Is drinks. Right. Drinks. Okay, very good. So you have Third to remember person. that no matter what topic we're studying, you cannot forget about the basics, okay? You always have to keep that in mind. Yes. And it's time for us to combine them. So. There is another way you can combine this. There are many, many ways actually. For example, as much water as. All right, we can put this in the present perfect, for example. So I have drunk as drunk. much water today as Lucy. So the fact that we're studying as much as doesn't mean as we cannot, yes, like this, as much as. The fact that we're studying this structure, guys, doesn't mean that we can only limit the structure to the present simple, right? We can use this in past, future, whatever you want to think, all right? Anyway, that's a feedback. Okay. Now let's do the exercise. Uh, number one, Monica. Number one. Good. Um, good In my opinion, houses are just as expensive as apartments in my neighborhood. So number one. Number one, no, oh. number three. 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 Yes, three is correct. Okay, very good. Mr. Moreno. 
two. Uh, my neighbor, my neighbor house has five bedrooms, but my house uh, uh, isn't as big as his. Number yep. three. Perfect. Right next, Mauricio. Uh, I don't to live in apartments because because they. I don't like to live porque, in apartments. Uh, porque ellos, mm, no, don't translate number them. one. Number one. No. Number one. Okay, number one. It's one. Number one. Don't have as many rooms as houses. <clears throat> you mm -hmm. don't have yes. as much as many. Yeah. Yes. Very good. Let's see if that is correct. Falta una. The fourth. Oh, my new really? house does how? My, new, my new house doesn't as have much. As, much. As, as, as much much as much space as my old house. Let's see. Yes. Yep, everything right. Great job. Okay. Okay. Now what we're going to study is how to express wish. All right. Look at the structure. You're gonna learn that through the video. You know I'm gonna end up explaining something and practice it. So pay attention, please. Try to get as much as you can out of it. Can you the microphones? Let's watch. Present wishes that you have about your personal life, career, everyone. Present wishes that you have about your personal life, career, and health. For example, you'll be able to make the following expressions. I wish I didn't live with my parents. I wish I had a different job. I wish I were thinner. Before I present the material, what I would like for you to do is to listen to an audio program that illustrates how this topic is used. Your task is to listen carefully and complete some questions that I'll have for you at the end of the audio program. So, are you still living with your parents, Terry? I'm afraid so. I wish I had my own apartment. Why? Don't you like living at home? It's okay, but my parents are always asking me to be home before midnight. I wish they'd stop worrying about me. Yeah, parents are like that. And they expect me to help around the house. I hate housework. I wish life weren't so difficult. So, why don't you move out? Hey, I wish I could, but where else can I get free room and board? Yeah, it's sometimes pretty hard to pay the rent. I'm thinking of finding a new job. Really? What kind of job would you like? I'm not sure, but I wish I worked somewhere else. I'm tired of this place. I need to live somewhere more exciting. I know what you mean. Hey, maybe we could move to a different city. We could even be roommates. Yeah, uh, maybe. Now let me start by presenting the structure. The first thing that I would like to point out is that we use wish plus a past tense in order to refer to present wishes. For example, if I have a situation that is true for me, such as I live with my parents and I would like for that to be something different, that is a wish that I have. And in order for me to express that idea, I will say, I wish I didn't live with my parents, or I wish I had my own apartment. Um, if I think that life is difficult, for example, this is my present situation. If I want to express a wish that I have about that particular situation, then I will say, I wish life were easier, or I wish it weren't so difficult. Let's try to make sense of the examples that are on this chart. In order for us to understand those examples, what I would like to do is I would like to propose this formula here at the bottom. And so what we want to do is we want to take certain situations that exist in our lives and then we want to express wishes about those situations. The example that is stated here is I live with my parents. I would like for that to be something different, right? And so in order for me to express that idea, I'm going to have a subject. So in this case, the subject is I, then this is going to follow wish 
plus the subject again. Now the subject could be you again, or it could be another person, right? I wish I, and then the verb in its past form. So in this case, it happens to be that it's on a negative form. So we use didn't plus live. So I wish I didn't, and then whatever compliment, right? Didn't live with my parents. There we go. There we go. And as you can see, the other example is quite similar. I wish I had my own apartment. In that second example, we can see that it's no longer in its negative form. So therefore, we're going to use the verb in the past. So the example will be, I wish I had my own apartment. So this is going to be in the past. So let's try to make sense of that second example there. I can't move out. So what happens there? I can't move out. The only thing that changed was that I'm using a model verb instead of a regular verb. Um, but what you got to remember here is that the, mo the model verb can, the past of that is could. And so it's basically the same concept, right? We're going to say, I wish. And then we're going to have a subject again. I wish I. So what is the past of can? Well, we can easily say that it is could, right? There we go. And so that's basically what we're going to put here. I wish I could move out. Now let's try to make sense of the example, life is difficult. As you can see, the verb that we're using there is the verb to be. And something that I would like for you to learn at this point is that whenever we express wishes, we're going to use where for all of the pronouns. It doesn't matter if we're talking about I, he, she, it, we, you, or they. For all of them, we're going to use where. where. So that's basically what's um, here at the bottom. After which, where is used with all pronouns. So if we think about the example, life is difficult, and we want to express a wish, then we can say, I wish, and the subject again, life, where, easier. Uh, and of course, you can make that in a negative statement. I wish life weren't, weren't so difficult. But it's basically the same pattern that we're following. In the last example, my parents won't stop worrying about me. Well, what happens here is that I'm using a contraction there. So my parents won't stop worrying about me. In that particular case, I'm going to turn want or will not into would, right? So I wish, and in this case, subject my parents would stop, and then whatever compliment, right? What kind of wishes do you have about your life? And as I mentioned at the beginning of class, we want to express personal wishes. We want to express family wishes. We want to express health wishes. We want to express professional wishes, if you will. So I'm just going to have a series of wishes here, right? So what kind of wishes do you have about your bedroom? So an easy example, I wish my bedroom were bigger. What kind of wishes do you have about your school or job? Well, I wish my job were easier. What kind of wishes do you have about your appearance, the way that you look? Well, I wish I were thinner. What kind of wishes do you have about your family? I wish I had two children, right? And what kind of wishes do you have about your possessions? Well, I don't have a car, so I wish I had a car. That's a, just a quick example. Uh, and what kind of wishes do you have about your skills? I don't know how to program computers. I wish I knew how to program computers. 
and so on and so forth. So I would like for you to come up with your own examples about the kind of wishes that you have about yourself, about your family, about your health, about your skills. All right, so. On and so forth. So I would like for you to come up with your own examples about. Do you have questions about the topic? Is it clear somehow? No questions? I know you have questions. Mm -hmm. Why be repeat so head to so head to so dead. subject? All right, um, let me see what you got, guys. It's, it's kind of noisy, it's like somebody's looking for something. I don't know. Mute the microphone, okay? There it is. Now I'm, we're good now. All right, so we're going to practice speaking using this. Um, the structure, what is the structure? Subject. 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 Plus. Wish. 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 Plus. Subject. Subject. Plus. Verb in the past. Verb in the past. Plus. Complement. Plus. Complement. After wish if. Complement. All right. After which is subject? Uh, no. See, I oh, know will... subject which were in the past complement. Yes. Yeah, no, but you need the subject again. Yes. Yes. Another subject. Okay, so uh, we've been looking at examples that are talking about I. Yeah, all of them are I. But you can also talk about another person. That's why I'm saying that each time we learn something, it's not limited to present simple. You can use it in any tense, all right? Or in any subject. So imagine that I say, um, my brother, what is one wish you think my brother has? He? No, I would say my brother, what is the conjugation of wish for, for the wishes. first person? Wishes. Earn money. money. Wishes. My wishes. brother wishes. What is the subject again? He. He, exactly. He. So my he. brother wishes he earned more money. Okay. And this is not to express wishes only, but it kind of sounds like you're frustrated so imagine you're talking to a friend and say i wish i didn't have to uh, work so much for example right so it's like you're complaining a little bit so another example would be i wish i had more time during the day to sleep <laughs> uh -huh, okay i have more time to sleep do you guys like raise your hand if you feel identified with this <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Everybody's like, yeah. No, I know everybody agrees. All right. So that is how you express wish or even frustrations, right? Um, I guess you're ready to practice. I'm gonna send you. We're gonna practice something in groups, all right, and then in in, in small groups. So give me one second. Hold on. Let me get it for you. Give me one second. Hold on. Hold on. It's noisy, teacher. Sorry. It's noisy. Oh, yeah. Guys, move the yeah. microphone. Oh, oh, oh. No way. <coughs> Give me one second. Here it is. Found it. Okay, here it is. So, look at this. Uh, common wishes people have about their lives. We're gonna discuss that as a class, all right? And then practice in small groups. So add more hours to the day. Raise your hand if you wish you could add more hours to the day. Let me see. Raise your hand if you wish you could add more hours to the day. 
wish the day uh, was 30 hours. <laughs> Everybody, you can unmute the microphones now. <laughs> so how would you express that? Unmute the microphones, guys, so that you can participate. I'll try to spot. Unmute the microphones, let's participate. All right. So somebody tell me about improving your personality. What is something you would like to change? Giovanni, are you there? No, yeah. Yes, teacher. Okay, what would you like to change about your personality following the structure? Okay, uh, I wish I had more beer. No, but Bird. personality, Sorry. not appearance. <laughs> you said beard. Right? Okay, okay. That's yes. appearance. No, okay. that's a good example I... for appearance. Okay. <laughs> okay. Hold on, Miss Carolina. What would you like to improve about your personality? Uh, improve personality. Improve. What do you say, teacher? Improve is to make it better. Improve. Ah, better. Mejorar. Ah, mejorar. Mejorar. I wish. I have. Uh, I have mm -hmm. uh, more influence in the people. <laughs> ah. So I wish I were more influential. Mm -hmm. the people. Perfect. Hmm. All right. And one more example. Mr. Moreno. Regarding Oof. regarding going back to no hold on moving to a new home, what could you tell me? Uh, oops. Sorry, teacher. I wish uh or noise. Uh, I wish I wish I were to move a new home. I, I no I hold on. I wish I moved. Move it. Move it. I wish I moved to the place with the microphone. All right. So I guess you're ready to practice, right? <laughs> Please. <laughs> We're going to nice. practice this. All right. Can somebody take a screenshot, please? Take a screenshot and send it to the group. Your bedroom. We're gonna discuss this in the group. All right, let me see. Ah. Wait, guys. More hold noise, on. more noise. Hold on, hold on. I'm muting everyone, hold on. Okay, so we're gonna discuss this. Uh, did somebody take a screenshot? Send it to the group, please. Yes, yeah, teacher. There it is. Okay, we're going to discuss in groups then. Accept the invitation, please. Small groups of three. All right, there it is. Bedroom. Giovanni. Okay, let me 
Let me check the phone. It's about, sorry, it's about my bedroom, okay? I wish I, I wish I had, no, I'm sorry. I wish it were more space. Mm -hmm. More spacious too. or bigger. Spacious, uh, okay. In my or case, big. I wish I have a walking closet for my shoes. <laughs> My, I wish, uh, I uh, wear uh, easier. Okay, the, the, I think is, I wish my job were easier. Yes, that's perfect. I wish my job were okay. easier. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Okay. Thank you. Next one. Okay, um, uh, Juan, what do yes. you wish were different about uh, your app? My brother and my brother. Um, 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 huh? Was was <laughs> happy. <laughs> was happy. <laughs> okay. I wish, I wish, I had, I had uh, better skills. Yes, in that's right. <laughs> I wish I had better, <laughs> not a better because I want. Be, be, in English. <laughs> yeah, I have better English skills. Perfect. The English skills. You have good skills. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I wish I I ha no. I wish I haven't pimples in my face. Oh, if oh, my negative, face. Yeah, great, great. Uh, if it's negative, you're gonna say I wish I didn't have. I didn't have. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, other question. Uh, let me see. What do you wish were different about um, your life, for example? Oh, Rene. Uh, Tell me. Unmute the microphone when you speak, but when you are not speaking, try to mute it, please, because you have a lot of background, background noise. Please, please, please. Thank you. All right, mm -hmm. continue. Okay. Uh, the question is, uh, what do you wish were different about your life? With, <laughs> with a husband, I don't, I don't have children. Yeah, in my case, yeah, I knew to a husband. A person. <laughs> okay. I wish I will have... Alrighty, I guess you finished practicing. Can three people share three examples with us, please? Come on, come on, come on, volunteers. I wish I earned more money. I wish I had more money. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> what else? Who else? I wish I changed all my life. I wish I changed. Oh, I changed so all deep. my life. <laughs> what happened? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What happened? <laughs> I wish I paint my bedroom. Let me see Go ahead, Irene. I wish I paint my bedroom. No, but you have to put it in the past. Painting. Painting. Uh -huh. Okay. I wish I wish I had more free time in my job. <laughs> Very good. Okay, now I want to ask you. What do you wish? You wish you work more or less? Less. Less. Uh, okay. Less. Yes. All right. Less. So I want you to make a negative statement. I wish I. How do you make it in the negative form? I didn't. No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. All right. Didn't. I, didn't. I, didn't. Uh, I didn't. Work. Work. I didn't. For example, now we're combining everything. Very good. So if it's negative, you're, say, you're gonna say didn't and the verb, right? Don't forget. Okay. So two more people. 
share something with me, your frustrations. I'm not a psychologist yet. <laughs> <laughs> two more, two more. <laughs> Nobody? Oh, come on. Mr. Wilson, you can tell me something. Go ahead. I wish um, I wish I had more um, higher higher. <laughs> <laughs> He's the <a> honest. <laughs> okay, don't worry about that, guys. One more. More mustacho. <laughs> One more. <laughs> uh, uh, a thicker mustache. A thicker mustache. Okay, now I sent you something on WhatsApp, right? You know, we're gonna go student A, student B, meaning. Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Meaning. Oh, I lost it again. Anyway. I sent you something on WhatsApp. Check the phone. We're going to discuss those questions. So, so it says, where do you wish you lived? How are you going to answer that question? I wish lived. I wish I. Remember, it's I wish the I... word subject. Mm -hmm. um, go ahead, Monica. Sorry, let's I... listen to Monica. Uh, I, I wish, wish I lived I... in... Live. Live. I lived in New York. I wish I lived in New York. Okay. Why? Exactly. Then why? you're going to ask why, have a conversation. Why? Okay. Uh, Pay attention, guys. You're going to work in pairs, so I want you to speak a lot. Give details, practice your fluency, all right? Number two, it says, do you wish... Hold on. What food do you wish you ate more often? Mm -hmm. Good question. Does somebody want to help me with an example? I wish I I ate um, I eat no, uh, I wish I Chinese food. Chinese food. I deserve. Uh -huh. I wish I ate Chinese food I more Chinese often. Chinese food more often. Uh -huh, exactly. So make sure you're using the past and guys practice in pairs. If the other person is making mistakes, correct them. Okay. So in my case, I wish I lived in in Tutunichapa. <laughs> now I'm kidding. Why? <laughs> 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 Oops, I know. I know. Why? It's a... I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Better campanera. <laughs> or in campanera or <laughs> so yeah, you know, so yeah. No, but campanera specifically. <laughs> 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 All right, we're gonna practice in pairs. So hold on. I'm gonna move some of you. Give me one second. Carolina, I'm gonna move you. Because so, we had big groups the other time. So hold on. Okay, so I'm gonna move. Oops. Yeah, again, it's nice. Monica. Okay, I guess you're in pairs now. Hold on, hold on. One second. Hello. Okay, finally. Accept the invitation, please. Oh, thank you. And discuss as much as you can.
y me escaló. <laughs> Why? Because it's it's very close to my job. Where do you work? In Torre Futura. And where do you live? Sea Pango. <laughs> eh, do you live That's near Super Selectos and Don Bosco? No. In Escuela María Auxiliadora. Prados, near Prados, no. No, por la Guadalupe. <laughs> oh, I don't, I don't, I don't remember, but I studied it at uh, Don Bosco, so I know the area a little bit. Ah. Yep. Uh, who else? Do you study oh. here, teacher, in El Salvador? Sorry? Did you study here in El Salvador? Yes, I studied my bachelor's degree in, in uh, Don Bosco at the university. Oh. Yeah. And you, Diana, where do you live? I lived in uh, Mexicanos. Oh, what part? What, what? Sorry. What part? What area? Uh, uh, what area? Uh, near to Metropolis, Unicentro Metropolis. Oh, okay. I know. Mm -hmm. And yes. there you also have Mama Chus, right? <laughs> Uh-huh, yes. <laughs> yes. I used to go there every day. <laughs> really? Yeah, that's a nice area. I like it. Yes, yeah, to Mama Chus. Yeah, no. To eat. Metropolis, that area, I like it. Uh-huh. Yeah. You, Franklin? I lived in... I lived or I lived? I lived. In Ciudad Arce. In Ciudad Arce. Ciudad Arce. Near. <laughs> Do you know Ilasal? Yes, it's, it's uh, near. Uh, near you, right? Uh, near uh, about my job. Ah. Ilasal is around uh, two kilometers. Ah, okay, I see. I told you, right, that I studied there. Yes, in... Inside it. In El Batallón. Mm -mm. I don't remember very no. well. Yeah, yeah, no. Inside y la sal. I learned Inside. English there. Ah. Oh, yeah, oh. y la sal has the language Has center. a program. Yeah, so I... Superate, I studied there. Uh, yeah. uh. Is long I that. moved to to Argentina. Sorry, teacher. Why no. why did you move to Argentina? No. I wanted to study psychology, and University of Buenos Aires is very prestigious. Mm. It's free, it's free education. So if you want to come study, you can come. You don't have to pay anything. Really? Mm -hmm. And it's like a beca. No, no, it's just free. Just free. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> um, all right, now let's say uh, I wish I lived. Now say it in the past, but it has to be a different place, right? Continue. <coughs> I'm gonna check the other guys. Miss Guadalupe, Nana Hiron, are you practicing? Right. Yes. Okay, yes. Luis. Luis. Uh, we wait for. Guillermo, Guillermo, say something. Okay. Number? One. Number one. Yeah. What? What? Language do you wish? Do you understand? Why? Mm -hmm. Your answer is. Or oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Number two. Number two. That's what I look for. Huh? Do you wish you owned? You owned? Owned. No, owned. Don't pronounce the E. Owned. E. Okay. Owned. Owned. A pet fish? Um, do you wish you had 
a different name? I I wish ha uh, I wish had a uh, uh, no I wish I, wish I, I had mm -hmm. a different name because when I when maybe why uh, because I. I didn't visit visit visit, visit my family. I didn't visit. Oh, okay. or I don't visit. Visit. Uh, yo no he podido. Oh, I haven't been able to visit. I have oh, been able to visit visit my family. Yeah. Okay. Thank okay. Daniel Juan Mauricio is. What food? Let me see. Mm -hmm. What Number food three. do you wish you ate? Number three. It's okay. What, what food do you wish you ate more often? Ate more often. Eight. Eight. What is eight? In a bigger house, why, why not? Course. Number four. Number four. Do you wish uh -huh. that you lived in a bigger house? Why not? Why not? I wish. I wish. I wish. I lived in a bigger house because I like uh, living. Hello, Amplio. I like bigger house. I like bigger house. Oh, um, better, better house. Yes. Okay. And you, Chris? No, tú. Me? Yes. Okay. Uh, I wish. I I wish. In my case, I wish I didn't live in a bigger house because we are a small family. Only my son and me. Uh, with with your family. Uh huh. My okay. family is a small family. Okay, very good. That's and right. I didn't wish a big house. <laughs> it's bigger. Mm hmm. The next is for you. Okay. Mm. Uh, number five, mm -hmm. five. Number five. Number five. Number five. Do you wish <laughs> can and speak a lot? Yes. And Mister Guillermo. I like. I like. I like Spain. I wish. I wish. I wish. I wish. Wish. I. I do wish. I spend. I spend more. Okay. Teacher, why not? Tell me. Teacher, I have a question. Go ahead. Uh, when I say when I say I wish I didn't have a different name, am I okay? Yes, perfect. I wish I didn't have. Okay. No, you mm -hmm. know what? Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. It doesn't it doesn't make sense? It is okay grammatically, but it doesn't make sense. You have to say I don't wish I had a different name. I don't wish. Yeah, it's not the same to so say. No desearía tener otro nombre que decir deseo no tener otro nombre, tener, no tener otro nombre. You see what I'm saying? It changes the meaning. So you can put the negative form in the first part or the second part. Okay. So mean. the structure uh, the, the in structure, this case. The structure can be negative. It's just that it's not frequent. Like, no, I don't wish. Yeah, it, it, you can say, for example. I don't wish I, if somebody asks you though, 
like do you wish you were younger and you can say no i don't wish i were younger okay okay and it's okay, not the same you. to say okay. i wish i were not younger it doesn't hmm. it's correct hurt? in this second all right okay you say it again joan so for me it's a little confused but i i didn't wish no 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 i don't because that is in the present wish is in the present that's why we're saying we wish it, okay I wish, I wish. I don't wish. okay Okay. So I you wish. don't wish I had a different name. Uh -huh, exactly. Right? Uh, okay. Uh, why okay, okay, okay. and why not, Giovanni? Uh, why? Because <laughs> the dog. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. But if you're not speaking, mute it. Like I mute it now. Then oh. okay. Okay. Yeah, mute it when uh, you're not speaking. Your... Okay. Do you wish that it rained more often and why or why not? I wish that it rained more because I like the rainy days and also is is better for um como se dice cultivos cultivos no you can also say that For crops, you can say. Okay. Or for it's good for cult cultivation. Or crops, like what I told you. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. What question are you discussing? Um, number eight is student A. Great. But you're taking turns in answering, right? Yeah. Okay. Go on. Personas en el paz. But with what is expression ex, expression wishes is in past the verb uh, wish is a uh, expression in present. Y en pasado sería wishes. Mm -hmm. Creo que esa palabra no se puede poner en pasado o algo así. Yeah, uh -huh. Pero, 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 la, pero la, la, teacher la, puso, la teacher la puso en una oración que escribió. Ya, yeah, Wishes la puse con él. Puso, pero ma, él debería no tener que ir, por ejemplo. Dijo, dijo wish, my brother wishes yes. the earner more money. Yes, it is possible. What? It is possible. It's okay. It's possible wishes. Yes, you can okay. say I wish or he wishes. He wishes. Okay. okay. But uh, <laughs> the practice is in verb in pass. Yeah, no, yeah, but that is still in that is still the structure. So what are you talking okay. about, Mr. Yeah, but the number the, the number one teacher number one, number one. What number one. language do you wish you understood? Why? Sería, I wish, I, I wishes, I, I understood, I, wish, I understand, or oh, understood. I, I, I wish, I wish, yeah. I, I wish, wish I, I, I understood, I wish, I understood English. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. In the past, understood, understood, yes, ah, okay. English. Entonces, English. I wish, I understood, understood, uh, two language, for example, understood in the past. Understood? To understood. Language. To the. Understood. Yeah. Uh huh. That's yeah. the structure. Very good. Teacher, I I I go to my bed. I am tired. You're gonna go right now. <laughs> yes. Okay. No, we're about to finish. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, did you finish all the questions? 
Yes, the letter B, yes. <laughs> okay, great. We're gonna go back now. So you finished all the questions? Yes, teacher. Yes. It. All right, great. Or the majority of them at least. So I guess that now the topic is clear, isn't it? Yes. Yes. So the practice, yeah, I was listening to most of you and you were doing great. Any questions before we finish? No, teacher. No? Yes, I have I have one. Uh -huh, tell me. Uh why why we have to use I were instead I was. You can use both. The thing is that it's like second conditional that you say if I were taller, I would reach higher places so when it's imaginary and since this is a hypothetical thing it's imaginary you use where instead of using was but nowadays nowadays you can use both is that clear okay okay yeah, I, I know it's, it sounds weird because it's like i wear but if you have studied second conditional for example like if i ha if i were a millionaire i would buy a a ferrari for example but nowadays you can also okay. say if I was because it's imaginary. Any other questions? Okay. Always were. No, you can use both nowadays in reality, but it's better to say where. She where I wear. So one. But you can say was. Okay. Uh, anything else? No. No. Nope. So thank you very much for joining us. All right. Uh, we'll study a different topic tonight. I hope you can join. And have a beautiful night. Take care. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank Bye. you. Bye. 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 Good night. See you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you.